Most of us will spend just a few minutes inside each of our designated polling places, but for a select group of 2,000 people, they'll spend upwards of 13 hours inside each and every polling location. And now Casey's Tara Hall shows us why they do it and why you might want to consider doing it as well. The machines are ready and so are the bags of supplies to accompany them. The only thing the Johnson County Board of Elections needs between now and November 8th is 300 more judges to work the presidential election. It is very important as American citizen to vote. Johnson County Election Office, this is Dee, how can I help you? The hours are long and the pay isn't much, but for the fourth presidential election in a row, Dee Wells will be an election worker. Overseeing all the workers that uh, are working on election day, um, field any of the questions that come in from voters. First thing is you need to be a registered voter in Johnson County. Second, you need to be able to come to training and receive the training to do the work. And then third, you need to be able to show up at 4.30 in the morning to, uh, to help run election day. Johnson County needs 2,050 workers to staff its 209 polling locations. So far, 2,200 people have signed up to do the job. But to play it safe, the county has put out a call for more. The goal is to wind up with 2,050. And, uh, and, and so we prepare by having more than we need so that we can lose a few in each step. And that way we don't get caught short. Which is especially important this year as 80% of Johnson County voters are expected to cast ballots for the next president. Reporting in Olathe, Kansas, I'm Tara Hall, the Now KC.